Hey guys, it's Megan. Um, I just wanted to come on and film a really quick May favorites for you guys. Um, now, I know I haven't had a video up in a while, and that's because of um, that issue that I spoke about with my family. So, um, yeah. I just, I want to get back into the swing of things, but I just, you know, that's why I've been kind of MIA lately. Um, um, yeah, I just, I don't have that many products this month, um, so I guess I'll just get right into it. Hopefully it'll be a pretty short video for you guys. Uh, let's start with skin, I guess, first. Um, I've been really loving this lotion. It's the Aveeno Active Naturals Daily Moisturizing Lotion. Um, looks like that. So it's clinically proven to relieve dry skin, moisturizes for 24 hours, fragrance-free, fragrance um, and it's like really, the consistency is like that, but if you like could see it up close, it almost looks like it's oil-based or something. Um, like you can see it, and or you can just kind of tell when you look at it. And it doesn't say oil-free, so obviously it's got oil in it. And I like to use it on my elbows, my knees, and my feet, like my heels and stuff like that. Um, and then also I've been using it on my face at night since it's more of a heavier moisturizer. I just use it at night and um, wash my face in the morning. And it's really been um, working out for me really great. I really do love that. Um, I guess I'll do fingernail polish after that because it's the only other non-makeup related thing. Um, this is the color that I wore for almost the whole month. Um, and excuse my nails now, I'm about to paint them. But it's Peachy Keen by China Glaze. And again, it's like it comes off way more yellowy or something on camera. I do not like the color it comes off on camera, but in person it's like this really light peachy color. It's so gorgeous. So, um, if you're ever out where they sell China Glaze, like uh, Ulta, you know, somewhere like that, look at that color because seriously it is really pretty. Um, now to makeup. Since it's been, okay, I don't know what weather's like for everybody else, but I live in Arkansas. It's extremely humid. And if you watch the news, you've heard about all the storms in Oklahoma and Arkansas. And I'm right on the border of Arkansas and Oklahoma. And um, the weather's just been crazy. Like, it'll be cold and rainy and then hot. I mean, like, humid. I mean, it'll be like 80-something degrees, but it'll be like 100-something heat index because of the humidity. And I cannot stand it. So, I haven't been wearing, like, um, full face of foundation. I, like my color stay or my makeup forever anything like that i don't want anything heavy feeling on my skin so i've been just resorting back and using my sheer cover um it's a powder mineral powder thing um did I spell that no and basically it's like the bare essentials or bare minerals um stuff like that and if you're wondering it's in latte i don't know i'm wearing it right now um I really like it. I just basically put some moisturizer on, moisturizer on, concealer, and then put this on, and I'm good to go. So I really do like that. Um, I'm still, let's just go ahead and get this out of the way. I'm still loving my e.l.f. Golden Bronzer. Um, I'm having a really hard time talking today. You can tell I haven't done this in a while. Um, showed you it before. I use this every single day. Um, it's super, super shimmery, but it's summer, so I think that's okay. Um, but I really, really like it. It's only $3, so check it out. Now I can't close it. Oh. Wait a minute. It did close. I'm losing my mind. Okay. And then the next face, I really, I have like a ton of blushes. Like I probably should do a blush collection, but I really don't want to now because I plan on buying a whole lot more because I, as you guys know, if you've seen my videos, I absolutely love blushes. Um, but the one I've been using like this whole month it's just been one from the drugstore and it's a Rimmel London one and you see the little crown that is so cute um it's the lasting finish one in 003 pink rose and it's really pretty like it's just a pinky color that's what it looks like if you can see that it's pink okay it might not look pink there but it's pink I like that light's causing it to look not the color that it is. I don't really know. Um, and then... Oh, sticking to face. I really just went back to using my MAC um, Studio Finish Concealer. Comes in a little, like, iPod, iPod eyeshadow thing. Um, looks like that. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but I've made a really big dent in it. Um, and I'm in Indom U20. You can see that. 
and I use this today. I use it like all this week, um, all this week, all this month, and I've really just been going back to using just this. So I fell in love with it all over again, basically. Um, and then on to eyes. Okay, I finally tried out the Too Faced Shadow Insurance, which if you guys seen any of my other videos, I have the Palladio, Palladio, I just dropped it, um, something, and however you pronounce it. And I absolutely love it, and it's really cheap, so I just was like, not really wanting to try any other thing, but I finally did. And I'm wearing the Too Faced underneath my eyeshadows today, and I really do like it. I wear it all this month. Um, the only thing is, I have to like shake it up, if not, it's like separated and it's like watery or oily or something and it's like a hot mess if I don't shake it up beforehand but if I shake it up comes out as no problem um and the eyeshadow trio that I have been absolutely loving is from wet and wild and the colors down here it says sweetest candy right yep and it's basically like the walking on eggshells one but with a more pinky color for the eyelid this looks like that so basically it's like a really pretty pink brown and a pretty um, off-white shimmery brow bone color I'm wearing it today if you can tell um but really whenever you put this on your eyelids it doesn't really come off pink it comes off like a champagne color um, so that's what it looks like I really want one to come off pink for once. Like, that's why I bought this. I was like, ooh, pink. Red for summer. And it really doesn't come off pink. It's like just a champagne -y color. So, yeah, whatever. Um, oh, I have been trying out a new mascara, though, which everyone on YouTube talks about. And I've had this in my collection for a while, and I just never used it. Um, so it's not like it's, you know, dirty or anything or bad. It's perfectly fine. It's the L'Oreal um, Car Voluminous Carbon Black. And Lola Marie 7 talked about this and I absolutely love her and basically I just started using it and it really like makes my lashes longer makes them look blacker and holds a curl and it's just amazing the wand looks like that it's a really big wand I really just like this like I have been not using anything but this for my top lashes since I found out how amazing it was Oops. and as for the bottom um I use this Maybelline Define Lash Mascara. And for one, I love the tube. Like, it's a pretty green color. And the one looks like that. It's one of those, like, bendy ones. And it's like, yeah. It's just really good for your bottom lashes. It separates them and it lengthens them. Um, and so, I really like this. Yeah. Oh, oh, and I skipped a face thing. Since it's summer and I've been into, like, shimmer and highlighting and all that good stuff, I've been using my Benefit High Beam a lot, and it's so pretty. It's like a pinky champagne color, and I really like pink champagne colors anyway. Um, so yeah, I really like highlighting for summer, and probably for any time, honestly. And then the lip combo I've been wearing, like this whole month that I'm wearing now, is um, my MAC Angel Lipstick. You can see that. And Angel's a Frost. It looks like that. Let me swatch her. And seriously though, it's like my lips fit better. Like with whoa, hello. With um that is awesome. Okay. Without um a lip gloss on, like seriously, it's like the color of my lips. Looks like that. A really pretty just pink color, like a really basic everyday pink color. And what I'm wearing over it is Max Lip Glass in Nymphette. And I got this in a kit, so that's why it says not for sale. So I assume this is a mini size. It's a really pretty um, pink color with a gold undertone or gold flex in it. And it's really gorgeous. And that's what it looks like. So I think it's really pretty together. Um... And those were my, my favorites. Um, be sure to link yours in the down bar. I'd be happy to see them. Um, and I guess this wasn't as fast as I was wanting it to be. I'm at nine and a half minutes. So I guess I'm going to go ahead and get off here. And I hope you guys had a great month. And I hope to be hearing and seeing from you all soon. And have a great day.